It's time for Tech Time with Timmy. Hello, welcome to Tech Time with Timmy. In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to move photos from Google Drive into your Google Photos. So Google Photos is a cool photo storage service by Google that Timmy's talked about before. And when you can have it on your phone, it's on most Android phones. And whenever you take a picture, it backs it all up and it organizes it nicely. And there's even an option where you can have unlimited photo storage for free, which is really cool. So that's really cool, but if you have some photos on your Google Drive and you want to import them into Google Photos without having to download them from Google Drive and then upload them to Google Photos again, because that can take quite a while, and if your internet's slow, that can just be really annoying, there's actually a way you can very easily move them across from Google Drive to Google Photos, and it just takes a few minutes, really. So all you have to do is you do have to go on your computer. You can't do it from your phone. So go onto your computer and open a web browser and just go to photos.google.com and you'll need to sign into your Google account if you're not already signed in, but then you'll see this upload button here. But before you click on the upload button, you wanna make sure that your backup settings are set correctly. So click on this cog icon here and you will need to make sure you choose between high quality and original. So high quality with free unlimited storage is probably the most best option for most people and by default if you've never messed with this before it will probably be set to that already but when you do high quality with free unlimited storage the pictures will be slightly lower quality so they'll be not quite as high resolution and so the file size will be smaller but you do get to upload unlimited photos for free which is really cool and you probably won't be able to tell the difference when you look at your photos after they've been compressed into high quality versus when you originally took them. So if it's just normal photos, you could probably just go with high quality and you'll get the free unlimited storage. But if you really, really care about the quality and you wanna make sure the pictures look exactly the way they did originally, you can choose original, but it will use up some of your Google Drive storage. So the photos you have on Google Photos will count towards the amount of storage you can have on your Google Drive. And with photos, if you've got a lot of photos, that can start to fill up your Google Drive really quickly. So only do that if you really want the full quality, but high quality with free unlimited storage is probably the best option for most people. So once you've chosen that, you can just go back to photos and then click on upload. So you'd think clicking on upload uploads from your computer, but now you have the choice to upload from computer or Google Drive. So just click on Google Drive and then it will open up all your Google Drive files right here within Google Photos and you can choose the ones you want to upload. So we're under recent here, so if you've got a recently uploaded photo that's just recently been added to Google Drive, you'll see it right here. Or if you go to My Drive, you'll see all the files that are in your Google Drive, including folders and stuff. So just choose the photos you want to upload into Google Photos by clicking on each of them. So you can click on this one and click on this one, and you'll see down the bottom here, it tells you how many you've selected. And maybe you want this one and this one. And if you want to select a whole batch of them at once, you can click on one at the top and then scroll down a bit and hold on the shift key on your computer and click on the bottom one. And now we've got 20 selected. So once you've selected all the ones you want to select, just click on upload down here and it will start to import them from Google Drive to your Google Photos. So it's not going to be using any of your internet and it's going to be really fast because Google's really fast at things and it says 20 uploaded already. So you may notice that they have not appeared up the top here, and that's because the date they were taken is older than these photos. So if you had newer photos uploaded to Google Drive, they might come up to the top, but when you have older photos that are uploaded to Google Drive, they will go down the bottom to where you'd expect them to be if you uploaded them as soon as you took them. So if you want to find those photos, you'll just need to scroll down to whenever you took the photos. So as you can see down here, we've got this picture and this picture, which is some of the ones we uploaded from Google Drive. So they're in here nicely and they're sorted out into the correct date that they're meant to be. And you can click on them and you can view them and stuff. So that's really all it takes to get your photos into Google Photos. Timmy's imported a lot of photos from Google Drive into Google Photos like this. And it's really quick and easy. So that's all there is to it. And if you found value in this video, click on the like button down below and click on this if you want to see more videos like this, click on the subscribe button down below and click on the little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified every time Timmy makes new videos. So that's really cool. And that'll be the end of this episode of Tech Time with Timmy.